Good evening. Post task to practice recording. Practice a conversation with a partner. Thank you for calling the IT department. Hello, my name is Maria Ochoa and I need to file a complaint about my work terminal. I'm sorry to hear that. Please describe the problem. It was very slow yesterday and it didn't turn on today. Let me send someone with a complaint form. We can send a new computer in no time. Thank you. You're welcome. Again, thank you for calling the IT department. Hello, my name is Maria Ochoa and I need to file a complaint about my work terminal. I'm sorry to hear that. Please describe the problem. It was very slow yesterday and it didn't turn on today. Let me send someone with a complaint form. We can send a new computer in no time. Thank you. You're welcome. IT department. Calling. Thank you for calling the IT department. Hello, my name is Maria Ochoa and I need to file a complaint about my work terminal. I'm sorry to hear that. Please describe the problem. It was very slow yesterday and it didn't turn on today. Let me send someone with a complaint form. We can send a new computer in no time. Thank you. You're welcome. Practice a conversation with a partner. Hello, this is Max from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Joe. I work for peeps.com. We received a new printer and I need help setting it up. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joe. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Um, it's an Altipage MX30. Okay, first, make sure that the power cord is plugged in. All right, it is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second, check that the installation CD is in the tray. And third, once the menu appears on the screen, click on complete install. Can you repeat the last part, please? Sure. Click on complete install. Oh, I see. Thanks. Thank you for calling te technical support. Hello, this is Max from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name's Joe. I work for peeps.com. We received the new printer and I need help setting it up. Setting it up. Could you help me please? No problem, Joe. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Um, it's an Altipage MX30. Okay, first, make sure that the power cord is plugged in. All right, it is. Could you tell me what I, what I need to do next, please? Second, check that the installation CD is in the tray. And third, once the menu appears on the screen, click on complete install. Can you repeat the last part, please? Sure, click on complete install. Oh, I see, thanks. Thank you for calling technical support. Uh, when we talk about requests, there are different things that we need to know, okay? Uh, one of the things that we need to know is the uses for requests, okay? Uh, there are four 
different uh, things that requests are used for. Number one, to make offers. For example, we ask, would you like something to eat? Would you like something to eat? And the person may answer, yes, please. Or, I'm okay, thanks. In English, uh, we avoid to use no. We try to use yes, please, or we try to say thank you, but I'm okay. Instead of saying no, uh, saying no is considered rude. Number two uh, is also used for invitations. For example, you say, would you like you like to go to the movies with me? Tomorrow night? The person may answer, I'd love to. Where do we meet? Or what time? Where do we meet? Or what time? If the person accepts, or probably say the same I'd love to, but followed by but. I'd love to, but I'm busy tomorrow night. Busy tomorrow night. Can we do it some other time? Can we do it some other time? Okay. Also, requests are used to make requests. Now I say like that. A request. A, is a petition, right? So I'm going to just put here a request is you are asking someone to do something for you. So you're asking for favors. Okay. This here. Okay. So we can say. Can you explain this to me? I don't understand it. Can you explain this to me? I don't understand it. The person may respond gladly. What part don't you understand? What part don't you understand? Or the person may say, sorry, but I'm busy right now. Okay. Number four, number four, we use a requests to ask for permission. So B4, we ask for permission. Okay, so you are requesting permission to say, 
Can I go home now? Can I go home now? I have an emergency at home. Or you can say, may I? May I open the window? May I open the window? The person may say, yes, you may. Or the person may say, simply, Sure, go ahead. Or the person may say, thanks, but that won't be necessary. That won't be necessary. Or the person may say, thanks. But I prefer to keep it closed. Thanks, but I prefer to keep it closed. Okay. So that would be another way of making requests. So please remember that Requests are used to, uh, to make offers, to invite someone or to ask someone out, to ask for a favor or to ask for permission. Okay, I hope that this information helps you. Okay, good luck in the next course. Take care of yourself. Bye-bye for now.